Hello and welcome to my Let's Play of Darkest Dungeon Part 87. Today I'm going to be showing you how to take down the Hag Witch. Uh, for this mission I have the this buff. Uh, it's not necessary, but it's pretty good timing because you're going to need as much much damage as possible uh, when you're going to be defeating this boss. Uh, I'm using an Arbalest, an Occultist, a Man of Arms, and a Hillion. But you don't need these heroes, you, you basically just need uh, heroes that can hit position 3 and 4. I mean here, yeah. But position 3 and 4. So uh, any abilities that hits the backline. Also, we need another trinket instead of this one, because it's a good idea to turn off the lights uh, in the final fight uh, against the boss. So let's pick a manslayer ring, because the boss is a human, as well as a focus ring. Alright, let's just go for it. Uh, and you need more shovels, or anti venom a single medical herbs, because we are going to be using restring crossbow. We also be going to using weapon practice, and dark strength, and unspeakable commune. Then you need two keys and twelve torches and sixteen food. And yeah, that's basically all we need. As time wore on, her wild policy of self experimentation grew intolerable. She quaffed all manner of strange fungi, herbs, and concoctions. Intent on gaining some insight into the horror we both knew to be growing beneath us. The change in her was appalling, and no longer able to stomach it, I sent her to live in the Weald, where her wildness would be welcomed. There is method in the wild corruption here. It bears a form both wretched and malevolent. Okay, so the boss is going to be right here. In case you didn't watch the last How to Defeat uh, a boss video, the boss is always in the room that's furthest away from you. That was unlucky, but we can live with it. Maker's art is efficacy unwitnessed by his own eyes. Um, feel free to skip if you don't want to watch me going all the way to the boss. Corruption. Malformed with misintent. Hazards possessed by evil intent. Also, this guy has Mankind Hater. It's not necessary, but it's a nice bonus if you have any heroes who can target human enemies.
singular strike. Confidence. It was a nice crit, actually. And a nice dodge. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. We have been pretty lucky with not getting any blight on our heroes from the traps. A decisive pummeling. Slowly, gently, this is how a life is taken. Unnerved, unbalanced. That's pretty unlucky. Oh, that's pretty lucky. <laughs> We might have to deal with having an affliction. And fury. More destructive than a hundred cannons. But it should be fine. Yeah, it gives bonus damage, which is actually very good. As the fiend falls. A faint hope blossoms. I'm going for the bolster right here. I think we need it.
another affliction. Irrational is not good. Gasping. Take him over the edge into madness. Yeah, it reduces damage. We should be fine. Famous last words. <laughs> there we go, now we can finally heal, which I think we need. She's quite dodgy. Very nice. The blood quickens. Mind that such missteps are the exception, and not the rule. Okay, they didn't want to eat. Perfect. <laughs> Let's go for some weapon practice. I'm not sure who to give the damage buff to. I think we'll give it to the man of arms since he doesn't have an affliction. And let's just hope for the best. This might fail, but I think it's worth it. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. Decimated. Consumes the mind. That's a good dodge. You know, at this point, he's also going to get uh, stressed out. The bigger the beast, the greater the glory. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Perfect, we have three afflicted heroes. <laughs> yeah, try not to bring heroes with like 50 and 60 stress into the final dungeon against the boss. But I think we'll be fine. Should be okay. Since I have the town buff, it sort of cancelled out the negative, right? Actually, I should have turned off the lights. I'm a bit worried about stress here. Powers of corruption. Come on. 
now we try and take her down as fast as possible. We are lucky we could have gotten some dodges. I hope she's not on death's door soon. It's a race against time. As life ebbs. Well, we might lose a hero now. Maybe? Survival is a okay, this is a terrible guide confirmed. <laughs> uh, yeah. Terrible duck. The way is still blocked, but less people will be eaten. I don't know what to say. I guess it's a terrible guide made by me. But I'll upload it anyway, because why not? Rest in peace, Annie. I guess she was not okay. A fresh irritant to some. A sanguine memory to me. Thank you for watching.